What up, Toast? It's, uh, it's your buddy Ian here, and uh, no, I didn't get dressed up for this video. I just uh, I got off work not too long ago. But uh, So you want to lose weight, and I happen to be a fitness professional, so I think I'm in a position to help you out. I mean, not only I do work for what is it, 24-hour fitness, but also studying this. Uh, it's my personal training certification. If you are interested in becoming a personal trainer, they are the best people to go through. This is from the National Academy of Sports Medicine. Um, it's pretty much the baller personal training certification. It's accepted everywhere. It's expensive, but it's worth it. Anyways, so you want to lose weight. Um, well, the, the a big part of weight loss, and they say it's anywhere from 60 to 80%, is going to be all in your diet. Obviously, you have to exercise, but the most of the battle is going to be in what you eat. So, some little quick tips for you um, in weight loss. I don't know what your diet's like, so it's a little hard for me to mold a plan for you. If you want, you can always message me, you know, with, you know, like your diet, like what you eat right now, and then maybe I can pick that apart and use them in more detail. But, in general, here's some things. Carbs, I mean, everyone talks about, you know, cutting carbs. Yeah, that's very true. You can still have carbs, but you want something more like whole grains. Like if you have white rice, you want to switch that to brown rice, white bread, whole wheat, you know, that kind of thing. Um, oatmeal, that stuff. Only have carbs in the morning because it's your long-term energy. You want it in the morning so you can burn it off throughout the day. Um, sugar. Obviously, sugar is what turns into fat, so you got to, like, minimize that. In terms of beverages, um, water, just that's that's the only thing. If you just drink water, that's a, such a huge part because, I mean, like, people drink sodas and juices and everything. I know juices don't, don't sound that bad, but you want to cut that out and you just want to drink water. Um, let's see. I have a high-protein, high-fiber diet. Um, so that's a lot of vegetables. In terms of your protein intake, I would say fish. I don't know if you like fish. I know a lot of people have this and they don't really like fish. I personally love fish. I like salmon and sea bass and you can get that in a lot of places around here. I don't know where, I know, I don't know where in Virginia you are and if you have access to that. But if you can, fish is going to be your best friend. Um, white meat chicken. You don't have to boil it, although that's the best way to do it. Um... Yeah, like eating a lot of salads. And um, in terms of snacks, almonds are great. Just regular, plain old al roasted almonds. Um, that'll be really good for you. Also, there's this thing out there called flax seed. Um, F-L-A-X seed. It looks like, they look like sesame seeds. Tastes like peanuts. I mean, having like two tablespoons of that a day, you know, like I put it in my peanut butter and jelly sandwich in the morning. Um, or I grind it up and I mix it into my protein shake. It's really good because it's high in omega-3s, and it escapes me right now what omega-3s exactly do, but basically meat is full of omega-6s, and you need to balance it out with your omega-3s, and it's just to make sure that your body is functioning properly. Um, and if you can, try to eat as often as possible. Eat small portions throughout the day. Basically, you want to keep your metabolism constantly running so you're always in that your body is always in that energy burn mode, and you like you'll always you'll have a lot more energy, and you know the fat will just kind of come off a lot quicker. Um, yeah, I mean diet. That's kind of like a little quick thing. I don't want to make this video super long. Um, but let's see. Oh, and salt. Also limit your salt because salt is going to cause your body to retain water, and which is going to make your fat cells expand, and you know, won't make you fat. Um, lastly, in terms of supplementation, I highly recommend supplementation. It works. It really helps the process go along faster. And, I mean, I know there's like hundreds and hundreds of different kinds of subs out there. I'm going to run through you the basic ones. Um, first of all, real simple. Get one of these. Um, some kind of multivitamin. I take Centrum. You can get one a day, whatever, just so that you, you know you have all the your essentials, you know that you're gonna need for the day. Um, 
Secondly, um, amino acids are great. These in particular ones, I'm not necessarily going to recommend. Um, I bought them, and it's it's a good product. It's just for me. I'll, I'll, I'll show you. It's a... Uh, yeah, I mean, these bad boys. These pills are huge, and they are really hard to swallow. No homo. But, um, yeah, it's... It, I've choked on these on multiple occasions, so I don't plan on buying them again. It's just too much of a pain. Um, the amino acids, just like the, the vitamins, they're going to help with your energy level because basically your body is going to be functioning properly. It's going to have everything that it's going to need. So, it's, again, it's going to help with your metabolism, help you burn everything. Um, and also, the amino acids will help in maintaining your muscle mass, you know, because you need lean muscle mass in order to burn fat. Kind of think of it like a... Remember you had your, your Ninja? It was a 600. Um, now, now you had the VFR 800. It's got a bigger engine. So think of your muscles like your engine. You know, you need to... If, you need to make it bigger in order to burn more fuel. So... Or not necessarily bigger because you can increase your muscle density, you know, and that does, has the exact same effect. Basically, you want more muscle tissue to burn the fat. Um, lastly is the protein shake. I personally recommend gold standard. I mean, I've dicked around with um, the GNC brands, uh, something more generic. Um, I eventually stumbled upon this, uh, and it worked for me, especially, like, um, I, I had lost a lot of weight. Like, I dropped, like, 60 pounds, and, like, and I leaned out, and then I wanted to build up muscle mass, and that's why I was taking those protein shakes. Um, the GNC one, I think I kind of just stayed at the same weight, and then I took this, and so far I've put on about 15 pounds with a lean muscle mass, so it's been helpful. Um, main thing, I don't know if you can see here, but you want, what is that? Crap. These uh, BCAAs, this is going to help uh, maintain your muscles you know, your lean muscle mass so that it's not, you know, getting broken down after you you work out. So, you know, it's going to have a high protein content. It's 24 grams per scoop. Um, I, you know, the a normal diet requires in the neighborhood of about 40 grams a day in, in order to put on, to stay toned and, and put on more muscle, lean muscle mass. You want to consume, you know, double that is a good number if you can. And that's what the, obviously what the subs are for. Um, to get you get you to that point, I like take two scoops a day. You know, it keeps me pretty. Um, it keeps me toned when I need it to be. So, yeah, uh, yeah, this video is running long. So, um, yeah, basically, in terms of supplements, you want um, your vitamins. You want your amino acids. Um, you want your protein shake. Uh, like I said gold standard is is great um and if it doesn't have bcaas which is your branched chain amino acids like i like i pointed out that one has it you can always buy them buy those too and um that's all you really need all that pre-workout stuff and nitric oxide and and fat burners and stuff don't really recommend it i mean if it's it's kind of it has really negative effects um if you don't know how to use it properly these are a lot safer to use. Um, I recommend them. Uh, you can try Vitacost.com. They have really good deals. If you go to GNC, they're going to rip you off. Like this jug at GNC is like $80. Um, but you can go to Vitacost or I go to this, uh, or you can go to local shops. I don't know how it's going to be on the East Coast. Um, but yeah, like the, the guy that I buy from sells me that same jug for $40. And yeah, I mean, you know, it, it all helps. So with uh, with that, I mean, I'll probably, I'll try to give you some workout tips too. But in terms of diet and supplements, I mean, that's a general like idea that you want to need. So I hope this is helpful. Um, if you have any more questions, let me know. Or if anybody has any questions, let me know. Uh, send me a PM or something and I'll uh, do my best to help you out. Okay. Anyways, uh, good luck. Bye-bye.